Y'all, I ain't playing about this. I'm getting skinny. I'm not playing this time. What it do? Welcome to welcome back to my channel. If you are new, it's your girl June. <coughs> Sorry, my voice is kind of going in and out. It is Friday. It is 11:42 in the morning. I'm in such a good mood. I have to go to work at one, but I wanted to chat with y'all today. Um, so I'm in the process. Well, I just made breakfast, and I'm in the process of making my lunch. So I decided to just come and chat with y'all. Granted, I know y'all probably don't want to see me cook every little thing. But this hair looks so good. Period. Anywho, so for breakfast, I made some scrambled eggs, mushrooms, red peppers, green peppers, yellow peppers, and onions. And then I put pepper jack cheese on it. I put garlic powder. Oh, I do red crushed peppers. I got pepper jack cheese, but I did garlic powder, the salt grind, and then the pepper grind. And then I got an avocado. I need to get some everything but the bagel seasoning because I really like that on my avocado. So that is for breakfast. Very demure. This is not very demure, okay? I'm just trying to eat less. And then for lunch, I'm going to do some brown rice. I did some roasted kale. Yo, I used to make roasted kale all the time. But like I said, I kind of forgot how to cook. So I made this a little bit too lemony. But I'm going to eat it. So it's just um, red onion sauteed in the pan little bit of oil, then when the onion saute, put the kale in, a little bit of lemon juice, I put red crushed pepper, um, garlic powder, salt, grilled pepper, and then I'm gonna make a chicken skewer. Um, it's just the ones that I've been eating from Kroger, so I'm gonna put that on the grill, on my little panini first, which I've been loving that real bad. I love that panini. But then I'm gonna bring some electrolytes. I had blue raspberry yesterday, Chef's kids, I think I'm gonna do peach mango today. Yeah. All the same boosters. This actually smells really good. I think I'll be scared to put this on my clothes. How much are these? $20 is not bad. Mm. Yeah, that's not bad. Mm. Wednesday, 12, 12, 12, make a wish. Um, <clears throat> I'm off today. I don't have any plans. I don't want to do anything yet. I hate to say that, but I was going to go for a walk this morning, but it's just so hot. It's 90 degrees, severe weather warning. I want us to go walk to get a coffee. I have no coffee. I have literally no groceries at all and the stuff that i do have i don't want it okay so last week i started a weight loss journey and i don't know i kind of started slow really 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 slow speaking of let me go with something to drink uh, i think i'm gonna do this peach mango one but yeah anyways i started a lifestyle change last week and the first week i just wanted to literally not eat out when i tell y'all since I've been in Dallas, I've been eating insane. Like, one thing about me and depression, I eat my food. I eat my depression. I eat it. I don't play. So I literally went from since March to April. Well, March to literally last week of August. I will order breakfast. I will order a snack. I will order lunch. I will order dinner. Order, 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 order. Literally, and all the shit I will order will be like a thousand calories. I don't fucking know. You know, you don't know how many calories it is, but 
So I'm trying to limit myself into eating at least like 1200 to 14 calories. And I feel like this week, well, some days I did good, some days I did not do good. But for the most part, I've been making all my food at home, so obviously, you know, that's less calories. And then um, I haven't ordered any food one time. Actually, I ordered ramen and I did not feel good. I had just started my cycle when I ordered ramen. So that, and then, I don't know, the thing that gets me is like me binge eating at night. So I need to figure out like, I need to go to bed early. So, um, it's Wednesday right now. Next week, I'm gonna implement a bunch of other shit. But it's Wednesday. We got like one, two, three, four, five days left from this week starting on Saturday, or starting on Sunday. I'm gonna start working out. I have a gym in my apartment, so I'm gonna go to the gym maybe like, I'm gonna try to go three times a week. Try to go three times a week. I don't wanna like force myself to do some treatment and like, you know, you know, when you force yourself to do shit at the beginning, you fall off, but yeah. So, um, I'll try to go to the gym three times a week or at least go on a walk. It's just too hot. I would prefer to go on a walk though, but it's just too fucking hot. I do need to get some workout shoes or just like some different shoes. All my shoes are like for work. So there's a two like platform chucks. I have these in white too. I have like some hot pink chucks, um, platform bands. Like most of my shit is just like shit for work really. Um, I don't have any regular shoes that I would use for going for working out. So I didn't need to buy me a pair of workout shoes. Um, I wanted to buy me some workout clothes. I was looking on Shein. Shein really only had workout leggings, so I think. I could just buy me a bunch of workout leggings and then go to Target or Walmart and buy a bunch of graphic tees and then just work out on that because at least I'm doing it, you know? But then give me some workout shoes. Um, what else was I going to say? Yeah. So I bought this cute little scale. Y'all know. Anything that's pink, I want it. Um, <clears throat> I want to show y'all the box, but the box has my address on it. <laughs> so, yeah, the front of the box, I got my address on there. It came in this box but it's literally so cute it's a mini pink scale um it goes up to 400 pounds um and um yep it's cute so i weighed myself i went to the doctor weighed myself and obviously i still weigh the same just because i mean obviously i didn't think i was about to lose 500 pounds in a month in a week but um i don't know i weighed myself that night then I weighed myself this morning. So I think I might be down a pound. I don't know for sure. When I weighed myself at night, it said I was three more pounds higher, but you know, you weigh more at night. And then when I weighed myself this morning, it was like a pound point five. I don't know. So I think I lost a pound, which is good because I ain't been losing nothing. I've been gaining. So yeah. And then Starbucks email me. Their pumpkin spice is back. But you know me, I didn't order. So we got two little bag eyes, two little BX, and I am so excited. Um, I got a pumpkin spice cold brew. I'm kind of annoyed because I wanted sugar-free syrup. So the drink was like six dollars. And I wanted sugar-free syrup, and if I swapped it for sugar-free syrup, I had to pay for sugar-free syrup, which is, why do I got to pay for one of sugar-free? Okay. But it was $2.85 to get two pumps of sugar-free syrup. So I just got regular syrup. Uh, so then I got some egg whites. I got uh, the... I think these are like the ones with the roasted peppers in them and the cheese. I should've got sriracha because I like my show spicy. And then here's the star of the show. Dang, they ain't give me no straw. Pumpkin cream cold brew. My nails are so cute and little. But yeah, so excited for her. Take a peek 
picture. I want to do a little dump. Camera flash. Camera flash. Camera flash. I never lived somewhere where I literally hated my upstairs neighbors. I freaking hate them. I don't know who they are. I hate them. Yesterday, they was on the phone at seven in the morning on the patio, which means you're upstairs like on the highest floor. There's another floor below you. The patio is right there. He's talking about, they got hella charges, SRTs, Hellcat. At seven in the morning, you're be yeah, at seven in the morning. That's not in the way. You couldn't tell them about the cat the SRTs at like 1 p.m. when I was at work. Anyway. Oh, I'm gonna drink this first sip without the um without a straw. First pumpkin spice of the autumn, because it's not fall yet. Cheers. Mmm. This would have been so better with sugar-free vanilla. It's okay. Hi guys, what to? It is Saturday, 8.37. I just got off work. I went to Target after work and got like, I really just needed like some protein snacks, just a couple things. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got. My apartment is a disaster. I thought I was gonna be off tomorrow which is Sunday so I was gonna do my normal Sunday reset but I'm going to get my apartment together tonight I don't go to work until 11 granted y'all don't care I know but I don't go to work until 11 so I'm gonna try to get my apartment together tonight so let's just go over the things that I got so far I tried to get a lot of things that were high in protein because I'm on like a high protein joint <sighs> I got some kombucha. Um, the kombucha that I normally get has 19 grams of sugar in it. Okay, so I got these. Um, this one, peach, uh, pineapple peach is so good. This has um, nine grams of sugar in the whole bottle. And then this one is good. This one has 11 grams. Fuck, I should've got two of these, but yeah. This one is mojito, which just tastes really good. This one is pineapple peach. Get some of those. I'm gonna try to go through these really fast. I got Target brand cold brew. I feel like I've tried all the cold brew before, so I wanted to try this one, which is crazy. I haven't really been craving coffee, but I I, I be wanting the coffee. I want to make it. I don't be like feeding for it. I used to be addicted to coffee. Like every day I wake up, I had to have a coffee. Now I'm not really like too thirsty for it, but I still do like to taste the coffee. Okay. So, I got these um, Fit Crunch high protein bake bars. So, they have 16 grams of protein in one bar, three grams of sugar, and they look like this. Then, I got these spicy and cheddar, um, spicy cheddar cheese crackers. They're kind of like cheeses. They're spicy. It's four of them in here. We're going to try these. I need a little snack. Cute. I know that I hurt you. And then this morning I did get some Amazon food. We'll talk about that after I get done with this. I got Kodiak cakes. Um, I got some protein oatmeal. Kaylin told me to get these. Hey Kaylin, if you're watching. Um, but this is peanut butter chocolate chip. This little cup has 14 grams of protein in it. Hey, I like it. Put it in the microwave. You good for breakfast. Okay. Then, I love hot stuff. I bought these. I've seen somebody talking about these on TikTok, saying that they're good. So I hope these are good, because this would be my new little protein chip. Then I got these. Um, these are like Fritas. I thought these were egg white, egg white bites, but yeah, they're Fritas. Um, so these have bacon, mozzarella, spinach, caramelized onion, and Parmesan cheese. And then these have 13 grams of protein. Hey, I like it. I got some granola for my yogurt. Okay, we almost done. 
Okay. I got um some liquid IV. This one is passion fruit. Y'all, this little thing. Amazing. I love it. It's three of them. Yeah. Uh, it was five dollars. So, and I didn't want to get a big one because I wanted to try different. I wanted to try a different flavor. Um, yep. Yeah. Anyway, so these are my favorite Kodiak um, power cups, s'mores, bro. So fire! It's so good. Got the graham crack, got the marshmallows. Yum. Twelve grams of protein. This is the same one I showed y'all. The peanut butter one. I got that. Y'all, I ain't playing about this. I'm getting skinny. I'm not playing this time mm -hmm. i got these um hello happy gummies i don't know if these actually work i don't know if this is a placebo effect i'm about to take one right now i have not been in a good mood not necessarily a good mood i just be like aggravated quick and just like over shit quick so i don't know how many are you supposed to take one a day oh wait you'll say one Oh, two. Okay. And then this is um, Hello Happy Gummy Worms um, for upbeat mood, vitamin D, and saffron. So hopefully that work. If they don't work, it'll be a placebo effect, and I would think that they're working because I took them, which they were $20, so them hoes better work. I did not know Starbucks had Nespresso pods. I have not had no Nespresso pods for a while. Granted, I'm about to order me some from um, Nespresso. I'm waiting until they get their fall collection in for me to order them. Um, but these was $11. I got blonde roast, and these are just espresso pods. So I'm excited about that. I already talked to y'all about this. And then I got these beef chomps. Y'all, I have been so obsessed with these beef chomps. I'm going to show y'all what I got from Amazon earlier. But these are the jalapeno ones. One little stick is 10 grams of protein. There's no sugar. Hello. I literally cannot live without these Lunchables, y'all. I can't live without these Lunchables. I love them. Love me a little Lunchable snack. Then I got some poppies. Y'all know this one is my favorite one. Um, I got cherry limeade this time. Another rosé. And then strawberry lemonade. Then I just got um, some more like scrubber pads. Presto nails. Y'all, these little Presto nails from Target by LA Girl. These are the ones that I have on now. Um, they're $3. And I got this fire ass nail glue. And girl, these have been on since Tuesday, Sunday. And one nail lifted up when I was, was out yesterday. But that was it. Normally my personal nails would have been pressed off by now. I'm going to link that glue below. It's fire. But yeah, that's me. And then I got this. I missed this Dove body butter. Missed it. I need to stop buying shit. <laughs> I went to Sephora again. And I bought this pink bomb, pink lip balm, Summer Fridays. This is the pink sugar. I seen Chelsea with this, and it was pink, and I love pink, and I needed it. So I got this. My cousin has this too, but Chelsea was the one who really made me buy it. Period. She had this, I think, I don't know if it was on her recent vlog, but uh-huh. I love it. I'm so excited. Yeah. Then this perfume was also a Chelsea purchase. Hey Chelsea girl, thanks for this video. Well, this portion of the video. But she has been raving about this vanilla skin. And I wanted to try it. Y'all know how I do, how I get down. I get a rollerball. If I run through the rollerball, then I buy the real perfume. Oh. Oh, that's good. That's a con. Oh, yeah, that's good. Oh, and then when it dries down, this smells really good. It smells like caramely, kind of like brown sugar, hint of vanilla. Oh, this is tea. 
This is good, okay? You ate that, period. Um, yeah. I'm gonna let y'all go. Anyways, enough rumbling. Um, I want to make a protein coffee today. And I don't know if I want to use cold brew or if I want to make shots of espresso. I feel like making cold brew would be way easier. Because, um, oh yeah, let's make cold brew because we can try the cold brew that I got from um, Target yesterday. The other thing is that I need to order some glasses. I need to get some glasses, which y'all know. Normally, I will buy my glasses from like TJ Maxx Home Goods. Every time I go to TJ Maxx, I, I've been going to the same one over and over and over. But every time I go, I don't really see any glasses that I like. And I don't want to order none on Amazon. I just want to be at the store and pick them out and then have them here. I feel like, I don't know, ordering glasses don't feel right with me. Okay, so this is how it's set up. The kombucha, Gatorade, protein shake, and then poppy. Um, I don't think I'm putting nothing else over here because this is basically the most amount of stuff that I need. And I got Lunchables, um, I got yogurt, grapes. I'm gonna put my um, soda waters in here. I'm gonna get some today. I'm gonna get some eggs today too. And yeah. I'm trying to stop eating out because y'all know like literally my first month here, I was eating out a lot from like March, literally to like a week ago almost two weeks now so yeah okay so we're gonna try the target cold brew and then y'all see all this shit right here we're gonna clean that off don't worry um but we're gonna try the target cold brew i don't know if i want the cinnamon roll protein shake or if i want cookie dough cookie dough kind of sounds good I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do cookie dough. And this whole entire, wait, sorry. This whole thing is 30 grams of protein. I'm probably gonna do half of it, so that'll be 15. I can't do this whole thing. I can't. And then for breakfast, I'm probably gonna do it. Mm, I think I might just eat a yogurt. I put some granola on there because I'm not really in the mood for food. But if I do a yogurt, the yogurt is 20 grams of protein. And then that premier protein, half of that is 15. So at that point, we'll be at like 30 or what? 35 calories of protein. That's cool. We can just do that. Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to like get used to like all the angles and then I put my coffee pods in there so cute I cannot wait for um I'm not rushing anything but I'm so excited for like um vlogtober and all that because I want to decorate my coffee bar real coffee like real no real fall like real festive so yeah oh shoot I forgot about these should I try um I forgot I had these Kodiak pancakes. So, should I try this oatmeal? Should we try that? Should we try this oatmeal? Because this oatmeal is 14 grams of protein. And I feel like this oatmeal will probably keep me fuller than the yogurt. So, yeah. Let's do this oatmeal and make us a protein coffee. Okay. So, 
it does look good. I'm gonna let it sit for like 30 seconds to cool up and mix it all up though. It smells good too. Okay, period. So I'm gonna let that sit for like 30 seconds. I am more of like a fruity girl. So I wonder if I can find these on Amazon, but for like strawberries or something. I don't like maple. I don't like syrup. The smell of syrup just is disgusting to me personally. So I don't like maple, but I like strawberry. So I'm gonna let this cool down, finish drinking my coffee, which is pretty good by the way. It tastes really nutty. And I don't know if that's from the coffee or the protein. It's one of the two. Let's try this real quick and then I'm gonna let y'all go for the day. Cause I wanna chill. It's eight, I don't go to work till 11. So I think I'm gonna go downstairs, get my air mattress and then just chill until 10 when I start getting ready for work. This isn't bad, it's just hot. Uh oh. So, for one, it's not bad. For two, I'm not really an oatmeal type of girl because of the texture, so I'm making faces because I'm trying to like put it down. But I know. This little cup of oatmeal is going to keep me full throughout the day for, for the morning time. So, yeah. This is pretty good. If you like peanut butter and chocolate, I'll try it. Um, I'm going to try to find, like, a strawberry one, like I said before. But it's not bad. It's just hot as hell. And then I got to get used to the texture. Um, I'll talk to y'all later, okay? Bye. I'm about to eat. So, I'm going to do some grapes. I need to order some more grapes. These grapes that were from Amazon Fresh were very fresh, very busting, very tea. The only complaint I have is that it said that they were seedless. These got seedless. Okay. Do I need to cut the stem? No. Do I want it to not be as dramatic? Yes. I'm gonna eat some of these protein chips. These are so freaking good, y'all. These have 19 grams of calories in it. All right, what? 19 grams of protein. Okay. And they just remind me of like flaming Hots. Some of them don't have much flavor to them. And then there's some. grams of protein and I wanted to do all this full talk shit on a separate vlog because if you don't want to see this you don't have to but if you do you can put it on this little bread that I showed you earlier I normally like to put cheese on here but I don't got no cheese I do have cheese but like it's like string cheese I like slices <coughs> as fuck. Oh, this bread got six grams of protein. Period. Okay, let's see where we. Hello. This head been getting lower and lower. I feel like the cheetah girls. With cheetah girls, cheetah, gotta do what I gotta do. Anyways, <clears throat> I'm talking to my cousin. But let me check out my little, I'm going to eat dinner. It's seven. I might not eat dinner. This might be my dinner. Okay, so here we go. We got grapes. We got our sandwich, the 
bun, six, pro, six grams of protein. The tuna that's on there was 17. And then we got our protein chips, spicy. Them hoes is real hot, tread lightly. This was 19 grams of protein. Then we are gonna drink some electrolytes. Look what IV, white peach, she's so good. Did I tell y'all that I got passion fruit? So fire, I think, I don't think I told y'all. Oh, I think I did tell y'all when I showed y'all all of the protein sinks I got. Yeah, I got that in here. Um, I was not drinking enough water with these. It has to be like 16 grams of water or some shit. 16 ounces, I don't know. But so I just filled this whole thing up, put the thing in there first, mix it up, fill the whole thing up with water, and then I got ice. Y'all know I need everything to be real cold. two shots of espresso or espresso two shots of espresso in here and i'm going to use this um premier protein shake it's 30 grams of protein i try to get at least like 80 to 90 grams or sorry 80 to 100 grams of protein a day i can only calculate the protein stuff that's like put on there like i don't know how to calculate chicken turkey all that shit i got a food skill but I don't even know if the food skill says it on there. You ain't my friend. You is my enemy. I wanted to do the whole thing, but like, um, I need ice. Oh, okay, never mind. We good. I could put a couple ice cubes in there. <laughs> So good though. Yum. Damn, I want more ice. guys i'm at home goods i just got this perfume oil y'all this smells so fucking good this pistachio dream i should go get another one because this one's actually leaking everywhere oh but it smells so good then i also got this one jasmine and cedarwood y'all know i love, love, love a little witty this smells good too but the pistachio one chef's kiss but it's literally leaking everywhere so i'm gonna go get another one but Okay, so I really came here for some cups, but I cannot find them. But I found these instead. These are just cute. They literally look just like this, except for they were a little different. I'll insert a picture. But I like these. So I think I'm gonna get these. And they're $8. They also have these, but I think I like them all. these better. Hold on, y'all. Y'all, look what I found. Sugar-free. I'm so excited about this. 